A huge party in Charlotte today for the Super Bowl bound Carolina Panthers. This was a scene this afternoon. Players, coaches, Charlotte's mayor and Governor Pat McCrory all there along with thousands of fans to show their support. And the Panthers leave for the West Coast on Sunday. WNCN's Michael Hyland is live at the Dick's Sporting Goods in Raleigh with more on the support building for the Panthers all across the state. Michael. Just as quickly as all of this stuff is getting here at Dick's, it is right out the door again. Just take a look at all this. They're getting between 15 and 20 cases worth of Panthers gear every single day. There's been a lot of foot traffic in here since Sunday when the Panthers won the championship. And today, thousands of fans got together in Charlotte to show their Panthers pride. It's the final countdown. The countdown toward a chance to make history. To prove to the nation what Carolina can do. Now the Panthers are like us in Carolina. They said we can't do, and we do. Thousands of fans packed into Romare Bearden Park so in Charlotte. Okay, Charlotte, you gotta believe! For the first time in 12 years, the Panthers are in the Super Bowl. This time, hoping for that first ever win, taking on the, the Denver Broncos. A week from Sunday, make sure we can hear you when we're in Santa Clara. Make sure you're cheering for us. Former Charlotte Mayor and current Governor Pat McCrory stopped by. The Honorable Pat McCrory. Though some fans weren't happy to see him. He had a clear message for the rest of the country. The national media gives Charlotte no respect. Cam Newton didn't get the respect that he deserves. These players didn't get the respect they deserve. But guess what? They've earned it. Now there's just one more thing to earn. A victory. Charlotte! What's our goal? We're going to win the Super Bowl! The crowd at that rally has been estimated to be between 25 and 30,000 people, but it's not just Charlotte getting in on the action. Coming up new at 7, we're going to show you what this Panthers fever has meant for local fans and for businesses here in the Triangle as we get closer to Super Bowl 50. Live in Raleigh, Michael Hyland, WNCN News Now.